Hi, I'm Alan, and as I told you, I'm the CTO of Sua Musica. Sua Musica is the biggest Latin American music platform for independent artists in the world. We support more than 16,000 verified artists in publishing and distributing their music on the platform to more than 10 million monthly active users. Our content is 100% user generated, meaning anyone is invited to upload music they've created. In 2020, we rewrote our Android and iOS apps in Flutter and started testing the Google Ads beta plugin. Since we are a free platform and we need to monetize each user the best way possible, we must have a great UX UI, but how it's done today, with overlay banners, we can hardly call it an OK experience. Because of that, we were excited to be invited to participate in the private beta of the Ads plugin, where we could implement those banners in the widget tree, at last. Just like a normal widget. Simple and clean. This made it possible for us to create the best experience possible for our users, while still monetizing from advertising. Ok, let me show you how it works. We want to put our banner right here on this part of the album page, so when we scroll, it will scroll together. We start by creating a stateless widget that receives add unit name and a list of sizes. Then we will define our banner as the publisher banner ad that receives our sizes add unit listener and the publisher add request. We can never forget to load the banner. On our listeners we're gonna listen for the loaded and the failed events and print on screen if needed. On our container now we just need to put our width and height and the magic widget that will do the trick, the add widget that receives our defined banner. Now we just need to add our newly created widget to that part of the page is the SM banner add unit I'm going to put the add unit defined before it's the add mob banner app with the sizes I will put the large banner it's the 320 by 100 just need to save how to reload and it should appear right now ah okay we forgot to save the widget okay hot reloading and there, there's the banner. It should also appear in every page. As you can see, it scrolls together with the, all the widgets as we wanted. That's it. You don't have to only take my word. We've had amazing metrics showing an increase of performance since we made the change. When we launched the new app with the Google Mobile Ads SDK for Flutter, we saw a 350% increase on impressions with a 43% increase on CTR and 13% increase on our eCPM. That's it. Hope you guys liked and saw how easy it is to insert ads in our apps with the new ads plugin.